to address crime. Um, the mayor, during his State of the City address, um, challenged the police department by putting uh, more police officers on the street, a more visible presence, and more interaction with our community. I feel we've been uh, addressing those uh, requests uh, to the best of our abilities. Uh, since then, our walk and ride component of officers getting out of their vehicles and walking their assigned districts has increased to uh, from 90 hours of average to 173 hours of walking foot posts. That's officers that are assigned districts in cars parking their vehicles and interacting with the community. Starting tomorrow, based on a rash of violence that we have uh, seen uh, last night and working with Mayor Matt, we will be placing officers on foot, uniformed officers on foot that normally work behind desks um, in the high crime or also known as hot spot areas in the city of Trenton. So starting tomorrow during the daytime and evening hours in hot spots throughout the, uh, throughout the city, there will be uniformed foot patrol officers, uh, hopefully to provide some relief to the neighborhood residents. Um, in addition, um, we are operating our directed neighborhood patrol initiative which so many council members and so many community members here have taken part of. That's, uh, that initiative is where officers, uh, there's uh, officers assigned to specific neighborhoods throughout the city, and it's going to continue through the summer, that we work along with the other directors, the other agencies and community leaders to do an evaluation of our neighborhoods. And again, it's not a cure, but before we can solve any problem in regards to crime, or any other social problem that we have here, we, as employees of the city, we as leaders of the city, have to see firsthand what our residents are living in. We've been through and through each neighborhood conducting evaluations, and the majority of the time interacting with the public, we find that the majority of the problems that are being complained of are living conditions. One, vacant buildings, trash, high weeds, poor lighting, and each and every one of those aspects, each and every one of those facts lead to crime. If we continue to allow these things to happen, we're going to continue to have crime rise here in the city of Trenton. We need to take some action. Uh, Cleveland, um, Burger, Cleveland Boston, and the other directors here, Business Administrator Eric Berry, they have committed. Um, we have had housing, we have had health, we have had the fire department out with us walking door to door and speaking to the residents. And this will continue through the summer in addition to our walking police officers. So there will be a visible presence of police officers in the city of Trenton. And hopefully, hopefully working together, we 
your identity. You will be able to speak with me uh, on a director's blog to let me know what you feel and provide some productive input in regards to what we as a police department